We're leaving hate in 2017 and we're working forward towards progress as we navigate hurdles and struggles to make sure that everybody gets to dip their banana in some chocolate in this wonderful, beautiful melting pot of a country we got. Elizabeth Warren will write an open letter to Donald Trump and racism will be obliterated forever. Check. Bitcoin bubble round two. Bitcoin will rise to $50,000 a coin and then fall back to $21,000. So make sure you buy all your coins now before you miss out. Ethereum will overtake Bitcoin for a short period and then fall back to a close second. A further prediction in the vein of this is that John McAfee will actually eat a dick on a pay-per-view live stream, and it will never be made clear whether or not it was his. Women will leave showbiz entirely and start their own Hollywood, and it's surprisingly good. Yes! Someone will put a fleshlight on a drone and injure themselves terribly in a VR porn stunt gone wrong. Billy Joel Armstrong from Green Day will kill himself probably soon. The dude is a mess. I know this video is a joke, but please, somebody actually help him. Shopping mall safety squads of soccer moms with Tommy guns will patrol the food courts of America, keeping them safe from terrorism. Jeans will finally go out of style, being ousted in favor of hemp and wood fiber slacks. Thank goodness. North Korea will disassemble its arms program over a tweet from President Donald Trump. Consider that. State mandated traps will finally break into the mainstream and I bet you Canada will be the first to do it. People stop using the phrase daddy in a sexual context and instead start using the phrase come czar, or at least I will. Game developers will stop trying too hard to be inclusive with their content because racism is over. So we'll go back to normal and we'll get Time Splitters 4. Some madman will produce a shaky but overall usable Nintendo Switch emulator for the PC and VR is going to be actualized. VR chat becomes the new Facebook where even your mom will socialize with people who may or may not be there. Retinal records of every citizen in the nation will be mined by VR chat's usage statistics telemetry and quietly stolen by a hacker group with some goofy name that sounds like a B meme from six years ago. They will threaten to sell it to Russia and Donald Trump will roast them. Good on Twitter and then they'll sell it anyway. Retinal scanners on all military and federal buildings will have to be replaced, causing the taxpayer a massive amount of money. This one might bleed into 2019. A prominent YouTube personality will run for a public office. An app similar to the makeup app will remove septum piercings and face tattoos from women to show how good they would look if they didn't go to college. Net neutrality will rear its ugly head around the end of the year and brutally murder Netflix like this scene from Special Victims Unit, saving us from all of their terrible original series and egregious reboots. You will all know what the word joke means by the end of the year. And one of those weird stunts that social media companies do, Tinder will add a map feature akin to Snapchat and it will end in fucking tragedy. Craigslist killer 2 shit. So those are my predictions for the year 2018. May we have a safe and happy new year. God bless.